Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome first retired City of San Diego Fire Chief John Thompson, the CEO of San Diego County Building Trades Council Tom Lemon, local philanthropist Susie Spanos, Chargers President A.G. Spanos, Chargers President John Spanos, Congressman Juan Vargas, Congressman Scott Peters, Congressman Daryl Issa, Chargers Special Advisor Fred Mass, Chargers Chairman Dean Spanos, NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell, Chargers legend LaDainian Tomlinson, Chargers quarterback, Philip Rivers. Chargers head coach, Mike McCoy. Chargers Pro Bowl quarterback, Jason Verrett. Chargers general manager, Tom Telesco. And our host for today, NFL Network and San Diego's own, Alex Flanagan. this event and look at you all in your jerseys and San Diego gear. Yay! Without any further ado, Dean Spanos the chairman. Thank you, thank you. Wow. Uh, it, this is absolutely overwhelming, uh, the support and the showing here today. I can't thank you enough. My family can't, the Chargers organization cannot thank you enough for being here today. I also want to thank all the congressmen for being here in support of this initiative. They are great, great, great individuals, Democrats and Republicans, and that's what it's going to take to get this done. And of course, I want to thank uh, Philip Rivers, who said he was going to be here all night to support us. Jason Verrett, great, great guy. And LT, who came all the way from Texas. He's special, I gotta tell you, you all know that. Listen, I just wanna say thank you. Uh, we have a tough road ahead of us. We have several big objectives we have to obtain before the end of the year, obviously. One is to get these signatures in a very short period of time. Get it on the ballot for November 8th and, and win this thing. for being here today and showing your passion for the Chargers and this great community. And we thank you very much for that support today. But as Dean says, we've got a lot of work to do. Uh, this is just the beginning. And we all salute Dean Spanos' decision, his family's decision, to make it work here in San Diego. The Chargers do belong here in San Diego. Let's put a big round of applause together for LT. Five years since the Chargers have been in this community, which happens to be your favorite son, the late Junior Seah's number 55. And let me say this, if Junior was here, you know where he would be. He would be sitting right here. And in fact, he probably would go to each door in this community because this is where he's from to get those votes. That's how special he is. I wish we played this afternoon. Well, you all know how uh, easy I can talk about football and the X's and O's and my teammates and our team 
and getting ready for a game it's because how much I love the game and my teammates and what we get to do and it's also easy for me to talk about San Diego because I love San Diego my family and I are so thankful we've been able to call San Diego home for for 12 years and you know last year the, the last game against Miami, I know you all felt it as well as we did. It was very emotional because we thought it was over. We thought it might be over. And I was seeing, I was thinking about all the memories and y'all making the LT chance and all the times we handed it to him and he dove over for touchdowns. And, and it was a tough year, but you know what really was very clear last year to me was that what our team means to the community and what the community means to the team is way more than what happens between the lines. And we're going to win a lot of football games this year and the next. But it is way more than that. It's way more than that. You know, I saw Ralph Bernerska a little while ago, and I think about the blood drive, and I think about the many other things that ties the community to the team and how special that, that bond is. And like LT said, 55 years uh, and all those players that have been here and have been involved with the community and all the uh, dads and moms and grandparents and aunts and uncles that, that took little ones to games and now they're taking theirs to games and just what it, the special bond that that community has. And I mean, dad gum, I mean, I... <laughs> I know that there's a lot of work to be done and there's so many people doing so much work and there's so much yet to go and maybe I'll look at it a little simpler, but I mean, it just makes sense, right? So let's get it done. I hope I'm still around to play in it, but uh, let, let's get it done together. Can't wait to see y'all out there this fall. Go Chargers.